Hello everyone, what is cooking all you good looking people out there and welcome to another exciting episode of This Week's This Can't Be Real. This week we are playing Empire TV Tycoon and today we shall continue. Day one, I'll be back, the Terminator. Um, oh yeah, we're playing uh, We're playing Skyline, that's our big, uh, big science fiction hit and um, yeah, that's what we're doing. We're right over here. Let, let's look at our game statistics a little bit more so we have a little bit of a better idea. Does time tick by? All right. So on that one, we're we're green, right? Yeah, we are we are green. So we're doing we're we're, ki we're crushing it on that one. Our economy, our income. Our our income's not too good. We've we've outcame 287,000 and we've we just haven't really we just haven't really done anything. So that's not good. Children seem to like us a fair amount. And, and geeks seem to like us quite a bit. The elderly don't really care too much. Okay. I mean that's not so good. What about admin our TV schedule? Let's 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 admin that. Panucci's pizza. I mean that's that's the big one, right? Panucci's pizza. That's our biggest one. That's the one where we're gonna get a big reward if we if we make it. So we're hoping we're hoping we get that. We got the Alabama fried chicken. We got our TV ad marketing. We still need to do a little bit more. Alabama fried chicken. We need one hour of that left and that one. So we're gonna have a little bit more. But over here, Skyline's not gonna do too well. I can guarantee you that much. But that's okay. Panucci's pizza. Still got all, still got all the good stuff left. Still got all, still got all the juices dripping right there. So that's good. I'm glad, ha happy to see that. Uh, what else do we need? We got uh, scripts own. We got two out of five. Movies own eleven. TV ads own four. Options. Okay, well that was easy. that was it's pretty self-explanatory as to what that did. Unread zero of eight. You can program a drama movie at twenty-three hours to complete the quest. Yeah. I, I do want to program that at 23 hours to uh, unlock the quest. I think it's going to be a good idea. Channel upgrades. Uh, we just don't have we just don't have the nuts to be able to do that. So I think we're going to be good on that front. Uh, let's fast forward time here and see uh, see how things go. Actually, let's, let's make it even faster forward. All right. So I think we I think we completed that. Still we still we still got the viewers. Which is good. Uh, now we can go to the director's chair, which is nice. So we're gonna go over there. We're gonna take our seat at the director's chair. See what do we need there? Okay, well spent resources. Great story. Wasn't as bad. You should watch this. Uh, okay, movie rating five point two. All right, I like it. I like it. We did well. The West is the best. It's a decent film. All right, there you go. The West is the best. That's gonna be that's gonna be our great film. Uh, so we now we now own that. We can play it and uh, and sell it. A good quality. That's oh, a good quality uh, untitled script. Okay, good quality. Um, new fantasy. Fantasy. We're gonna call that uh, under the. Armor. Aren't they the armor of love? Don't know what that even means, so we're gonna save that script. And you, uh, Space Nuts, Sci Fi Nuts, it's an average quality one. And Under the Armor of Love, a fantasy film. We're gonna have you write another script. Uh, what are you gonna be good at? You're gonna be good at uh, a, a comedy. Absolutely, I want you to write a comedy. All right, so you're gonna write a comedy, and we're gonna go to the directorial chair here. Eighty-seven thousand. We're still good on the block. Oh my God! Look at that pumping, pumping weight. In your movie script, filled with actors. Oh, we need to hire actors for a production. I see. It's good to see you. Uh, under the armor. Uh, let's let's do under the armor here. A uh, leading actor. Who do we got here? We're, we're still a one-star company, right? We don't have the... What's our fame? I don't think we have the right fame to be able to do anything, really. Uh, so who are we going to hire? Um, and who's good at fantasy? 
You're at five fantasy. You're at four fantasy. You're at five. You're at five. Five. All right, so we got Ben. Yeah, you'll be the leading actor, Ben. And what about Judy? What about Pamela? We should make a fantasy, you know, it's it's not... You know, we gotta have we gotta have a lady in this at one point. What about you, Pamela? You're pretty decent. Not enough fame. Not enough fame. All right, Pamela. What about Vince? Not enough fame for that one either. I bet you. Um. Well, I think it's gonna be Pam Parker because I don't want to hire somebody else that is not gonna like like. Rat Catcher? Is that his name? Oh no, his name is Ben. Alright, we're gonna yeah, we're gonna have Pam. Pam, you're you're in there. You're right, you're gonna be the wizard. You're the rat catcher and the wizard. Well actually what we're gonna do is we're gonna do that. Rat catcher and wizard. You're gonna be a great wizard then. Alright, pirate. Let's save and uh, let's save and pay the actors here. Congratulations on your film. You've done a great service today. So let's go, let's go check out, you know, let's go find out what we did here. Let's go find out if we did good. We still, uh, hopefully, I mean, hopefully this day, I don't know, we end up with something. Skyline, Panucci's Pizza, still doing well. Uh, it still looks like it's gonna do well. Our TV ads, we can see. Panucci's Pizza, we actually, you know, dropped down on, on one thing. Two days left, two days left, two days left, three days left. Okay, that's good. We've got time for Panucci's, so we should probably be, you know, concentrating on something else. Global Gym. Or Meta, Meta Mints. In fact, we'll put, we'll put on Global Gym. That's gonna give us a, you know, that's gonna give us a, an advantage here. We'll put Global Gym on there too. Uh, sorry, Global Gym on uh, right here. Alright. So yeah, we'll put Global Gym on both, because it, it, it hits, it hits the athletes. And the athletes is really what matters. Uh, each hour uh, blocks, we can hire an analyst. Well, their analyst is, is working hard, right? Hard at work doing stuff like that. Uh, now maybe we can maybe we can go down here. We can take uh, we can take an elevator. Advertising agency. I don't think we need any more. Uh, build entrance. Uh, well, it looks like someone stole our elevator. So uh, we can go down. Maybe we could go to the blue player office. Hey there. How's it going? No, that doesn't really help us. I was wondering if we could do anything about that. See the movie library. Let's go buy and sell some of our films here. Well, we've spent a lot of money making this production a little bit better. And we're not really reaping the rewards here. Uh, that's for sure. We can... These are all at 100%. And these are all at 100% as well. Eat Till You Drop even is on there. We could buy at $40,000. My god, Eat Till You Drop. You know, we had Eat Till You Drop. I don't know what happened to it. Let's go back up to our floor. Alright, coming up in the next block. Uh, let's fast forward there. We're playing the green channel. Green channel marketing. I mean, that's good to know. We got, we got the attention. People are watching. All right, 81,000 viewers, so that's another that's another success story right there. 80,000. I mean, are the numbers dropping? You know what? They're, they're dropping, but not that bad. Okay, that's good. So we, we hit that mark. Now what we can do is we can go over there, game statistics. We can see, boom. I mean, we got some big sets here. Those were big. In fact, we, we led the market with our big film. Which is great, because even though there was a little bit of a drop-off. Snowball TV. We're playing the drama. We got that. So, we actually hit that on their our TV ads. So, Alabama. It's going to need to be Alabama, isn't it? Yeah, it's going to need to be Alabama Fried Chicken. Alright, Alabama Fried Chicken. You're going in there. You're going to make us some big cash here. Panucci's Pizza. So Alabama Fried Chicken is going to do that, and then, uh, you know, Menta Spice or some crap like that. You know, I doubt... That's fine. Alone in the Dark, that's going to help. It's going to be a spooky movie. Everyone's going to love it. Alright, and we can go there. We've got lots of time. 
We got lots of time to uh, we got lots of time to do stuff. Master work quality script comedy. It's mast. It's a masterpiece. Untitled script. Um, that is going to be called. Geez, what it what it what would what would this be called? Uh, boy. I don't know. It's going to be called ah, geez, it's a comedy movie as well. This is the heart is a ma my masterwork. This is going to be called um Annoying Orange in Manhattan. There you go. Annoying Orange in Manhattan. Save that. Absolutely. So we got Annoying Orange in Manhattan, and we got Space Nuts uh, that's on there. You're going to be writing a script for us. Uh, you're, you're really good at comedy. I mean, it's almost unbelievable. We're going to write us a spooky movie. All right? There you go. So you're going to write us a spooky film. All right, what about you, our uh, market analyst? We could even upgrade your worker level somehow. Produce highway billboards. Absolutely. Make us some highway billboards. I mean, I think that's going to that's gonna help us to get some highway billboards out there. And I think we need to also create our production because I think we didn't do that. All right. We've got that. Available points, 170. I think it's going to be a standard film, right? Yeah, we're gonna make it a, a standard, a standard movie, standard movie. Um, and what we want to have is we want to have uh, what is it? It's called uh, it's a fantasy. Original score. I mean, obviously that's gonna need to be like an eight. And post production. I mean, obviously that's gonna be like an eight. And reality doses. I mean, that's gonna be like a one. Sound editing. That could be a four. Visual effects. I mean, that's gonna be like an eight. Makeup and, and hair industry. I mean, it's a fantasy, so it's going to be there. It's going to have a touch of eroticism. Uh, it's going to have some big points there. Scenography. It's going to have some big points there. And cameo roles. It doesn't really need to have those. Cameo roles can be uh, laid back. Sound editing. That's going to be a. Fu uh, that's going to. Be, that's. Excuse me. Oh, I see how it goes. I see how it is. Uh, then in that case, we'll go boom, boom. There you go. All right. Action. Boom. All right, action it is. All right, we've just actioned our, our film, which is great. Now what can we do? We can uh, we can hire some actors for the next portion. Still got 47K. I think what we need to do is we need to go and... Uh, actually, what I need to do is say, hope you guys have enjoyed. Oops. Uh, back. Hope you guys have enjoyed this episode. And as always... I'll see you guys next time. Aw, oh, yeah. Cue the royalty-free music. Three, two, one, go. Come on, everybody. Get on your feet. Stand up, look at the screen, and repeat. I'm gonna like, rate, comment, and subscribe. I love watching Aether vids all of the time. Thanks for dropping by and spending the time. Hope you've enjoyed, and let's get on with our lives. Aw, oh, yeah. Thanks to Kevin McLeod for these awesome beats. Ooh, yeah. Have a good one. Bye.